Today we're going to learn about the elements of art called form. We're going to look at Yayoi Kusama's artwork and how she used form to create her amazing sculptures. Kusama was born in Japan in 1929. She is a contemporary artist, meaning she makes the art of today. You will find her work in museums and buildings and fashion. She is still alive and continues to make sculptures, paintings, and installations or work that takes up an entire room. This piece is called the Obliteration Room, where visitors that enter this room are invited to cover it with stickers. Over several weeks, the room is transformed from a blank white canvas into an explosion of color with thousands of dots stuck over every available surface. Kusama uses dots over and over again because it helps her to stop worrying. By repeating a mark many times, her focus escapes her thoughts and fears. Kusama's forms are three-dimensional. They have a length, width, and depth. Her forms are irregular or freeform, but her shapes, like her circles, are two-dimensional and they are geometric. Her paintings are two-dimensional because they only have a length and width, and her sculptures or forms are three-dimensional because they also have a depth. Drawing prompt. Open your notebook to a clean spread and on the left page, fill it with circles in a variety of sizes, including small, medium, and large. Feel free to use markers in different colors. Take your time to fill up the page. Like Kusama, use drawing to calm you down, to focus, and not worry about anything else. On the right page, use the lines of the notebook as guidelines to make ovals shaped like eyes. Notice I'm using two line spaces to create the eyes. Continue to fill up the rest of the page with the same shape and feel free to use markers in different colors. When you're done making the eye shapes, fill them with pupils or circles in the center. Then add eyelashes by using zigzag lines around the eyes. Finally, fill in the pupils with tiny dots. We will use these shapes and patterns for our next art project. Thank you.